Howdy, y'all. Um, we're gonna do a short presentation on Baroque architecture, art, and film. And this is for Arch 250 Survey of World Architectural History, taught by Dr. Gabrielle Campagnol. And my name is Brandon Groff. I'm a history major, class of 2024, and I'm from San Antonio, Texas. My name is Samantha Garza. I'm an environmental design major, class of 2023, from Austin, Texas. I'm Nathan Barostegui, an engineering major, class of 2024 from San Antonio, Texas. The Baroque period occurred between the late 16th and early 18th century, emerging in Rome. It is characterized by a dramatic theatrical style evoking emotion and complexity exhibited in art, architecture, music, and other cultural regards. Two prominent artists and architects of the Baroque period include Gian Lorenzo Bernini and Carlo Rinaldi. Two pieces of work the architects collaborated on were the twin churches, the Santa Maria del Monte Santo and the Santa Maria del Miracoli. These churches were placed among a series of intricate roads and nodes derived from Pope Sixtus V's plan of Rome. The interior of the Santa Maria del Monte Santo exhibits an ornamentation and detailed line work, which is emphasizing the dome, the engaged double columns, and the archways. The articulation of detail generates a dramatic appeal to the architecture. Bernini was also a sculptor and created Baroque art in addition to architecture. The Rato di Pasapina reveals exquisite detail and evokes an emotive, dynamic sense of style. Disney has many nods to classic styles of architecture and design in their films. In The Beauty and the Beast, a mix of Rococo and Baroque is shown throughout the movie. These styles are seen through the plenty of golden accents in the ballrooms, the tension between the darker and lighter rooms, and the Italian Baroque style in the Beast West Wing. Along with the architecture scene in the movie, the Baroque style was shown through the contrast of the different social classes and their fashion. Thank you. Thank you.